Is that peanut butter? Mitch McConnell once again froze during a press conference. If we truly lived in a democratic society, there would be some sort of regulation being rolled out to prevent situations like this. Left or right, we can all agree that politicians should have their lights on upstairs. But there's nothing we can do because older generations are hoarding wealth and consolidating power. Boomers and the silent generation own over three quarters of the country's wealth. Half of all Americans are under the age of 40, but only 4% of Congress is under the age of 40. Meanwhile, 23% of Congress people are 70 or older. The result is policy that gives older generations a cushy ride into their graves through Social Security and Medicare, which would be great, but the chariot is carried by underpaid, overworked young laborers who will not be seeing any of those benefits when of age because they will run out and disappear because of the same boomers who are currently destroying the future environment and economy to their benefit. But the show goes on. In November, we'll vote for our favorite geriatric skeleton who will collapse in the Oval Office. Who's your favorite? I want to eat that.